Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. So, one thing um, I wanted to do real quick is I want to start putting together these little quick, just quick bite videos real quick. One, two minutes long, maybe a little longer because I tend to talk a little bit um, with little tricks on the pod go. So, today we're going to talk about how amp modeling and presets and all that good stuff work. So, as you can see, we are currently in edit view. Right now, in edit view, the way the pod go is set up, that if you change your amp model, it will also change the cabinet so that the amp and cabinet are always matched. This can be bypassed. So if you want to test out different heads through the same cabinet or same IR, you can do that. So what we're going to do right now is real quickly, we're going to go into global settings. We're going to press both page buttons at the same time. That is going to take us to a menu that's going to bring up global settings. I'm going to press this button here to get into global settings. Once you get into that area, you can go over to preferences. And then you can go to here where you, it says link amp cab. And you have two toggles for it. You have on or you have off. You can't really see that on the camera too well. But right above this, it'll say on or off. If you turn that off, you will always have the same cabinet, and then you can scroll through the amplifiers using that cabinet and microphone. So there you go. Just a quick little thing that you guys can use when you're tweaking your presets or changing stuff out and want to check stuff out. You don't have to have the cab that necessarily goes with that head. So there you guys go. Have a good one. Take it easy.